<sighs> I've always wanted to create one of those videos that I've seen other big YouTubers create where they tell you they're done with YouTube forever and it's very emotional but then later in the video only to tell you that they'll be doing more YouTube just in a different way. Well, this is that video for me. <laughs> ah, shoot. I just ruined my watch time. Honestly, it just, it feels like something's missing. I need to get uncomfortable again. This is the same feeling that I had way back in 2009 when I decided to get on that one-way flight to Buenos Aires, Argentina on a whim, a leap of faith that would forever change the course of my life. And I feel like I'm at that crossroads again. Hostel. Not sure what to do from here. So, well. By the way, I'm filming this at Balboa Park here in San Diego, and they're getting ready for the Christmas festival, hence all the Christmas decorations. All right, so what am I done with? What am I over? What's finished? And to be as direct as possible in this video, I'm done with the two to three week trips of traveling to a country and documenting as I go. It used to be great doing that. It used to be great because I would have six months to a year to spend in the place to tr truly understand the nuances of the culture, to dive deeper, to meet local friends, and to really immerse myself in the place. But these two to three week trips just doesn't feel like I'm, I'm going deep enough. Feels like I'm at times creating content that you could see anywhere else and I pride myself on being as authentic and as, as original as possible with this channel and it used to be great I would travel to a country for six months to a year I mean Argentina for a year Brazil for a year Colombia six months Istanbul Tokyo Philippines and truly dive into the place and create content that I was proud of but now it just for one I like having a home base for now here in San Diego. And so I'm taking these shorter trips and it doesn't feel like I'm, it feels like at times I'm just going through the motions. And with Croatia, it's such a beautiful place and the people are incredible, but I, I didn't get as deep as I wanted to. And Egypt the same way, great contacts there. The food video is amazing. We had so much fun, but again, somewhat on the surface to me. Hold on bell tower is going off. I've also realized that a large majority of the audience that's tuning in to watch these particular destination videos are people that are planning a trip to go there or who live there and it's not reaching a big enough audience from a, a, a storytelling standpoint and also straight up from a financial standpoint. Views allow me to keep living my dream essentially. With that said, <clears throat> I started to think about what makes me really happy in terms of creating content, what makes me feel alive. And the more I thought about it, the more I realized that it's the telling impactful stories of interesting people is what I really gravitate to. Even enjoy editing those types of videos. For example, the migrant camps of Tijuana, spending the day with a Navajo in Utah, and a Mayan family way out in the middle of nowhere in Mexico. These are the stories that I really love documenting. Long story, very short, here's the new plan. <clears throat> I wanna create videos based on this concept, uh, telling impactful stories of interesting people. And I thought the best way to do that, to package that for YouTube, for you guys, is with a day in the life. So the idea is to create 100 videos, 100 episodes, featuring a day in the life of an interesting person in each episode. And that can be of people from all different walks of life. That's the exciting thing. From Michelin star chefs and marine biologists to Muslims, monks, and Mormons all over the world. The idea is to document interesting people and gain new perspectives. The stuff that really makes me feel alive. And I already started to cultivate a list 
on garethleonard.com slash the list. So if you guys wanna go over there, I'll have the link in the video description, but if you wanna go over there and check it out, it is a work in progress. As I come up with an idea, I'm just writing it down on this list and I'm putting it out to the universe in hopes that one, it will inspire me to stay this course and create 100 episodes and also to seek help from you guys. I mean, literally everything that I've done to this point in traveling is because I've made connections with the right people and incredible people throughout the world. So this is the same thing. This is the same strategy. I want to put this out into the universe in hopes of, you know, inspiring you guys, getting contacts from you guys, ideas from you guys on interesting people that I should document. So it's something that I'm very excited about here on the main channel. Now this is the main channel. That's the big idea for this. But let me, there's more. But wait, there's more. <laughs> Switch locations. What if you're just here for the simple travel and food content? I don't want to neglect you either. While the Day in the Life series will be my heart and soul, it'll be my passion for what keeps me going in this content creation game and, and, and will help me move forward. I know that there's a lot of people that just come for very simple videos, which is great. So I've created two additional channels. The first is actually an older channel. If you want to go see some old, terrible videos of me, that's where I used to put bloopers, outtakes, additional clips. That is over at Travel Deeper. And that's where all my general travel videos will live from now on. On top of that, I guess another big announcement is that I will be releasing my Travel Deeper Bootcamp Travel Hacking course for free on that channel. I actually just launched the welcome video today, the same time as this is going live, and I will be releasing two videos every single week for the next like four months of content. So if you're interested in that and you didn't have a chance to purchase it, I will now be releasing it completely for free. I've realized what my passion is and that is to go out and tell stories. And it's not to curate a community based on email leads and click funnels and all those types of things. That's just not what I wanna be doing with my time. But if you did buy that course already and you're watching this, you will now have unlimited one-on-one -on -one access to me forever, whenever you need something travel related, a travel related question, you can now contact me directly if you were part of that community. But for everybody else, two videos per week over on the Travel Deeper channel. That's one additional channel. The second additional channel is Gareth Eats. For all of your food content desires, go over to Gareth Eats. That is a brand new channel. The first series that we're gonna film for that will be from LA. We're gonna go capture all of the LA food scene. So make sure if you're into the food content, go check out Gareth Eats. And there's also Gareth Eats on TikTok and Gareth Eats on Instagram. That'll be creating a lot more content around. So I hope that's not overwhelming. Those are three channels. This main channel you're watching this on, Gareth Leonard, that'll be day in the life videos. That'll be my pride and joy. The second will be Travel Deeper, which will have all of your travel information, course information for free, and eventually, I'd like to have some of you host on that channel, make it more than just me, but we're getting ahead of ourselves. And third, of course, food content, Gareth Eats. Make sure you go check that out if that's what you're looking forward to. Moral of the story is, if you wanna take something away from this video, I'm 13 years in of doing this and I'm still trying to find my voice. I'm still adapting and evolving and growing with every single video that I do, with every idea that I have, and it's not perfect. And I'm not competing with anyone else. What I'm competing with is what I'm capable of. And honestly, I feel like I'm capable of so much more. But the truth is, this video doesn't matter at all without execution. And so many people come to me and say, how do I start a YouTube channel? Oh, I'm, I wanna be perfect, blah, blah, blah. Ideas don't mean anything without execution because nobody cares what you're going to do. What I'm going to do doesn't matter. 
what I end up doing matters. It's the content you put out that matters. It's the production. Don't tell me what you're going to do. Tell me what you've done. And as you can see, a metaphor, empty stadium audience here. Nobody cares. No views on what I'm going to do. So I am nervous. I don't know exactly how this is going to work. I don't know how I'm going to move forward, but I, I put this out into the universe, take a leap of faith, just like how I started all of this and hope to land on my feet through hard work and through amazing people like you guys. That's it. Thank you for watching the video. Give it a thumbs up. I'm not done. I'm not over. I'm just changing the way I do things. I told you, I always want to make a video like this. I'm leaving YouTube. Just kidding, I'm making more YouTube. That's it. Happy holidays. I love you guys, I appreciate you guys, and I'll see you on the next one. Big things coming. See ya. Get the idea of that shot?